Hi, nothing much to report today. Except for the fact that I finished every single vlog. Shiz. Except for September 13th. But I'm caught up to September 6th. September 13th is um, the last one I have to work on. And like I, you haven't, I haven't worked on it yet, but on September 13th, I decided to go once a week instead of trying to do it every single day. Because every single day is a lot. It takes me at least two hours to edit the vlogs. And then it takes a little long, a little longer to render. So I can edit the week-long vlog and then just upload it on Sunday. And then anything I want to say in the middle of the week, it will be simply an i-log. As you can tell, it's raining. It's raining right now. And it's been raining steady like this all morning. It hasn't let up. It hasn't gotten stronger. It hasn't been windy. It's just been rain. Constant. Same amount of flow. It's just just like this. All morning long. I'm getting uh, some cigarettes, and I'm also getting some gas, because I'm out right now. So I'll be right back. Oh, I'm back. <laughs> I almost forgot that I had this thing on. But I think if I did um, daily eye logs, um, on, it, it probably won't be daily, but if I did regular eye logs, just talking about some new technology announcement or or anything that's on my mind at the time, I think that would be great um, to do. Uh, I'm ready for the bus right now, near where I live. Oh, no, that's not my bus. Darn it. And that's not my bus either. The allergies are really kicking my butt today. They really are. Damage looks better. It's the daylight white balance. I was using cloudy in the last video. Yep, it was raining yesterday. I'm on my first break right now. I guess a lot of uh, different online blogs were able to interview uh, Steve Ballmer of Microsoft, and they were talking about the pricing of Microsoft Surface. I think the big rumor that uh, came out about Microsoft Surface selling for either 200 or $300, I think at one time Microsoft was considering that, but it will piss off a lot of OEMs because Microsoft will make their money. 
believe it or not, there are a lot of OEMs that are really mad at Google for the Nexus 7, though the Nexus 7 is made by Asus. But um, they're selling the Nexus 7 pretty much at cost because Google knows that they make money on Google Play, people buy music on Google Play, people buy apps on Google Play. So they're going to make that money eventually, and they're probably sharing some of that profit with Asus, who is the actual manufacturer of the tablet. But um, Microsoft <laughs> may not want to do that because they have a good, they do have a good partnership with a lot of um, third-party uh, OEMs out there, and it will behoove them to sell it at the same price as most OEMs sell it for. So it's not a good idea. It will piss a lot of people off. And Microsoft needs that competition uh, with other OEMs in order to stay on top of things. Yep, I'm out here during my lunch break. But I want to show you, these are my socks right here, but this is my cast. Well, it's not my cast, it's a brace. I mean, I got my brace on. Kind of show you the other leg. It's just my socks. My ankle is still hurting. And it's been about three weeks now. I don't understand why it's still hurting, but uh, I guess I really haven't been taking care of it. So I'll put the brace back on, and I'm catching the bus everywhere I go now instead of walking 17 blocks like I usually do. I um, just take the bus from the train. I found the bus that goes from the train to uh, Whole Foods, where the Whole Foods shuttle pick up. And uh, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. What I wanted to do as well is um, I found a place a, a couple, a few B logs ago. I uh, found a bike shop on one of my walks to the train. And the bike shop also had, has a rental place. It's $35 a day. It's rental by the hour, but the max time is 35 hours. You can keep it overnight and bring it back the next morning. And I wanted to do that. I wanted to rent it, you know, get there, you know, about noon because I dropped my wife off at work. I can catch the train downtown, pick up a bike, and ride around downtown Austin and take you with me. I think that'll be fun. It'd be kind of hard to do if I'm holding the steering wheel and holding the camera at the same time. The camera would be like this the whole entire time. But um, at least I can, you know, stop stop somewhere and say, hey, check this out. Technology in the middle of, a, of a nature. You know, uh, but I can't do that right now because my ankle is still really sore. I can't walk long distances. I can't walk uphill very well. If I walk uphill, I have to take it very slowly. And climbing stairs is a problem, too. So, I don't know. It's probably going to be another week or two before my ankle heals up thoroughly. Just out of clock, rush hour isn't that bad right now. It's a lot of traffic, but 
not definitely not like much shower. Look at that line. There's a lot of traffic out here. the music on the whole time, huh? I may not be able to... I just recorded 15 minutes of video of front-facing driving, and the radio was on the whole time. I may not be able to use or upload any of that video because of copyright infringement. It's um, Thursday. Microsoft Office 365 is going to have a online training course on how to set up link for phones and voicemail for unified messaging so you can have a complete unified messaging solution for your Office 365 accounts because before charge our voice was an added option for Office 365 you couldn't have um, enterprise voice for link and um, what link is is um, if you ever work for a company and they had Office Communicator, or they have Blink. Well, with Blink, you can add um, voice. So you really don't need a um, phone system or a PPM system in order to run phones. You can run everything through your um, network connection. The only thing that's suggested is you got to have high-speed internet as well as uh, high-speed network connectivity so that you can support enterprise voice in your network. So you may need to do some upgrading. Whew. It's been a long day. I started work at 10 o'clock today because I had to run some errands this morning. And it's now 7 o'clock. Well, 6.30. So, just want to get on home and relax. Then what I can do, uh, I'm sorry, I was thinking, I was just thinking, out, I was thinking about something, something real quick, and just started talking out loud for some reason. <laughs> My old job, Star Hanks. <laughs> Getting paid a couple more dollars at my Whole Foods shop than I am, than I was over there. You know, this Saturday, I got to take this car in for an oil change. Also, got to do. Uh, one of those inspections or something like that, fog inspection, because my sticker expired. So I got to take it in to get uh, inspected. And I also got to register this car because it's, the registration is due this month. All right, let me get on inside and relax.
I believe it's the 19th, but I know it's Wednesday, and we're in the middle of September 2012, and what I also know is I'm going to work. Yay. And it's like 7.38 something. Sorry, YouTube, I didn't realize my kid thing was covering up the Leon. The Leon. Plus, you gotta love this shit. Just sitting in the top of the bridge, because you're on the bridge. Just sitting on the middle freeway and rush hour traffic. It is so tragic. Riding in the middle of the road. Come on, looking at most of these cars here. What are people doing? Texting. Okay, she's driving. Okay, that's cool. Um, person behind me. Texting. Okay, and I'm, I'm not going to say text anymore. You know what they're doing? They're playing with their phone instead of paying attention to the road. I don't know how people deal with this every day. I know. Oh, I wrote uh, Capital Metro about why isn't there a bus on the 360. And um, Highway 360 is where my job is at. And it's the middle of nowhere. And so I'm like, why isn't there a bus that services, you know, this area? You know, because we really need it, you know. There are a lot of jobs out there, and the traffic is horrendous during the day. And uh, they wrote back saying that when you put in a bus system, you also have to consider, you also have to work with Texas DOT, you know, the Department of Transportation, and figure out where the safest place to put bus stops. Unfortunately, Highway 360 has several issues. One, they don't have a uh, decent pedestrian sidewalks along 360. Two, the speed limit is such where buses aren't able to, you know, stop at bus stops and not able to merge in the traffic once it uh, leaves the bus stop. And Three, there's a lot of drainage issues with 360 that uh, Texas Dot hasn't really got around to fixing. So, in order for them to put a bus on Highway 360, it will cost millions of dollars. Now, I understand if they want to put a rail line, costing millions of dollars, but a bus system, a one bus route costing a million dollars is not worth the cost. I definitely understand that. I don't know if you got that on camera, but you saw that cop car that hopped the center medium there? Of course, they are they are now to do that. We're not. I'm check this out. I'm not sure what's going on because I can't see it yet. Something's going on. Yeah, it looks like some type of accident or something. All right, whatever that's about. No, no. They try to take his mouth, you know. Look at this. What's because of him? Oh my goodness. Really? Stop tailgating me, fool. Get off your fucking phone! Seriously?
get off your phone. Freaking Toyota. Okay, it's not this light. It's not that light there, and it's not this one here. It's the one right above it. Ah, uh, kind of hard to see it. That is a bright ass body of rock and hot gas. They say that men are from Mars and women are from Venus. Well, <laughs> I think I'd rather live on Mars than Venus. Venus is, that's probably why they say it, really. But, you know, back in the days, you know, Venus was beautiful. You know, uh, you know, of course, we didn't know what Venus was about. You know, we didn't know it was just a bunch of high compressed gas. And, you know, it, it was squashed us as soon as we even landed on that planet. And it squashes every single man-made product that's ever landed on that planet. You know, anything they send there, it only lasts in the atmosphere just for a few, you know, for a few minutes. And they're only able to get a glimpse of what it looks like underneath all the Venus clouds. So people actually thought that Venus was gorgeous from the outside. So people always said Venus is a representation of women in Mars is a representation of men. But when you look at it, I mean, I'm not saying Mars is livable. I mean, we can go to Mars and we die instantly as well because lack of oxygen and all that, but Mars is a lot more pleasant than Venus. But here's the thing, though. What you got to look at is that Venus is more like our planet than Mars is as far as the structure of it. Now, I'm not trying to be a man versus women or woman type of thing here because everybody's beautiful, man, woman, no matter what race or what type of thing you do for life, even if you're a street worker, every single person is a beautiful being. And I treasure each and every one of you. I just uh, posted a, well, a few days ago I posted a message to uh, Cricket on Facebook asking them if I bought the Lumia 920 straight up, how can I hook it up on a Cricket network if it was flashed? And, um, they told me that, you know, they can hook up any phone that's a CDMA compatible, which means that it will only work on Sprint and Verizon, whereas T-Mobile and AT&T, they use a different technology. And so it will have to be CDMA, CDMA. Now, as far as I know, Sprint is going to be carrying the Lumia 920, I haven't heard uh, much about Verizon doing it. So um, what I might have to do is get a Sprint version of the Lumia 920 instead of the AT&T version. But um, they say they can flash it, but the only problem is that it will only be phone and text. Data will not work on the phone. So I'm like, that kind of sucks because there are a lot of features on the Lumia 920 that are usable on a data plan. Like, uh, for instance, um, oh, what's the name of that? Okay, I don't remember the name of that feature, but there's a feature where you can point your camera at a building and it will tell you what that building is. Um, the Nakia Maps feature would be usable. There are a lot of features on that uh, Lumia that would be usable while I'm out and about, you know, trying to do stuff, instead of having to hook up to a Wi-Fi network every time I go somewhere. But the Lumia 920 would be also like an awesome tablet for me, especially if the uh, Microsoft Surface is way above my budget. As I said before, um, if the Microsoft Surface was $300, I would get that. 
two hundred, three hundred dollars, but that's the highest I can go right now. But um, if I'm getting a Lumia 920, pay full price for it, that will be that will be my tablet, you know, uh, in some form or fashion. But um, we'll see. I got a little while before my before my uh, bus comes, so I might as well come on down here. I've been coming to this bus stop for the longest time, and my ankle is doing okay. So got my brace on, you know, to support it. Going under the street. Okay. Let's see here. What is over here? Nothing. It's like a little walk path. A little creek. And a bunch of little gnats. I hate those things. Sometimes you walk into them and they follow you. I hate to fall on a bike on this. Go right into that little creek. I'm sure it's nasty as all hell. I don't even know where this thing goes. Yeah, it probably goes for a little while because this is a pretty long creek. Yeah, it's going to wind around for a good little bit here. But at least it doesn't stink. You know, this water here, this stagnant water, at least it doesn't stink. Most places you go to where the water just sits, it stinks because of the mold and mildew that builds up. I'm sure there's plenty of that in here, but it's not horribly bad. All right, uh, this is all there is to it, I guess. I mean, it's probably just a lot more trail to go here. But a lot of people ride their bikes down here. It's probably where the street drain. It drains through there probably when it rains. This kind of reminds me of the old subway tunnels in LA. The ones that were abandoned when they took away the trolley system there back in the 60s. Interesting looking building. Is that an apartment or no, it's a business? Yeah, that's a business uh, place there. All right, huh? This is far as far as I'm going to walk. I'm going to. Not sure where this thing ends, so it's gonna head on back. Starting my allergies are like horrible right now. Graffiti, you gotta love it.
everyone's safety. Please report any unusual activity or suspicious packages to Capital Metro Rail personnel. For la seguridad de todos, por favor, ve a disolver cualquier actividad extraña o paquete sospechoso al personal de Capital Metro Rail. Red! No, wait a minute. Red, white, and blue. Red, really yellow, and blue. See the red, and it auto corrects. Got the white, which auto corrects, and then the blue, which auto corrects not so nicely. Red, white, uh, yellow. <laughs> Okay, that was an American video dedicated to America and all the soldiers who are in the military, all the soldiers who served in the military, um, all the veterans, and I guess that includes myself as well, but this is to the other soldiers, soldiers out there who dedicated their life, limb, mental abilities, and all kinds of bullshit to serve this country and love this country, and I really do. Tomorrow, I got to get up early. I mean, like, early. Well, 7 o'clock. Well, Jiffy Lube opens at 7. If I don't get there before 7 o'clock tomorrow morning, I'm going to have to wait 3, 4, 5, 20 hours to get this car done. I need to do an oil change. I also want them to check a few things to make sure that everything is A-OK. -okay. And I also need to do that state inspection thing. We got to merge into traffic. Just like this. All right, everybody. Right now I'm going to the store to pick up some food. We're starving. We don't have much food at all. And my wife, she wants to get it. So that would be something really nice for her to get. I'm like, shoot it to the spaghetti tonight. Alright, come on now. Let's make this light. That takes forever to change. Thank you. You know, I'm going to go and get this car washed too. The car needs a wash. It's not at 30, it's the last time I got it washed, but hey, there's nothing wrong with getting keeping your car clean. One of these days I got to vacuum out the inside of the car because the inside is pretty bad. It's just like little dust and droppings everywhere. Okay, let's hope the credit card thing works here. Okay, let's see. Please select your wash package. Please take your receipt. Ah, these are cars. Oh, the wash is available. Thank Please you. enter wash now. I'm going to make sure all the windows are like. Rolled up. Okay. Woohoo! Okay, it's gonna tell me to stop at some point. No. Alright. And watch it rain tomorrow. You know, I'm going to move the camera around a little bit here.
Ooh, the big brush. Gary! Let me do this brush here. The side brush. And it puts my mirror off the way. Press it's gonna hit the other side now. Who saw YouTube at my finger above the lens? I was hitting the back twice. Hey, look, watch it while it does a dance. It does a little dance right there. It's like, oh. Watch this. Oh, I didn't do it this time. All right. my wheels right now. Somehow, no, I'm not going to be able to get it that much. It's been in the bottom side of the car. Now it's getting the tires. <laughs> That's a trip. It almost looks like it's alive or something. Ooh, it's spraying up some type of rainbow color or something or another. Yay! It's gonna hit my sunbook. Whee! Oh, it looks pretty! Whee! Oh, it's dark in here now. Can you see me? <laughs> okay, I don't know what's gonna happen next. Let's see. Something's gonna rinse this off, yeah. It's gonna get rinsed off. Well, I'm not doing a good job of rinsing off. I guess it's gonna be another spray. Oh, there we go. We got rain coming. It's gonna rain, folks. in Georgia, it would be totally dry and you see just this straight waterfall coming towards you. I think the next thing is going to be the big blower. Oh no, this is probably the... Oh! Okay, this is... I did the ultimate this time. So this is probably the rinse or the spot free rinse or whatever. Oh, you know what? There's a little indicator there on the right side that, that's telling you what it's doing right now. I wasn't following it, so. All right, here we go. We're about to get rinsed off now. Woo! And there's the blower. It's going to hit my antenna. <laughs> the antenna's going to fall off one day. I'm come back around and blow up some more, right? Because I still got water on me. Okay, here comes the big blowers. Woo! Can you imagine being outside?
I think that's it. All right, that was fun. That was actually more exciting than the um, other one that I went to, where it's brushless. The other one I went to um, in the last, in the vlog before, that uh, wash was uh, brushless. This one is, uh, just have brushes. It's like no contact wash, contact wash. It's, it's more exciting when it's contact. It's like you're totally involved or something. All right, I'm going to the store right now to get some um, stuff. And, because, uh, you know, we're starving right now. We're starving. I haven't eaten all day. And my wife, she hasn't eaten all day either. All right, I'm going inside. And right now I'm recording myself doing this uh, Google Hangout. Hey, what's up? And um, as you can see, I'm recording that right now. And this is the web page that the Hangout's on, and that's my agenda. And this is for you guys out there. I'm doing a Google Hangout right now, and I'm doing this live. So what up? In fact, you can see me on the screen right there. <laughs> just low so Don't forget to like this video. Shiz. Right, gotta go to the store get some more cigarettes. And this will actually be the last video that I'm going to be doing for September 16th through the 22nd. And the first of my weekly vlog. It's like almost midnight, the 22nd of September. <clears throat> Oh, this thing was forgot about this thing rolling. Don't forget to like this video. Peace out.